All right, you guys, so that is how you do a full glam, a full glam, and we bam, ba ba bam. <laughs> welcome back to my channel, guys. If you're new here, welcome back. You know what to do. Hit that subscribe button now. But today we're going to be talking about how to do a quick glam in just 20 minutes. Can I do it, you guys? Can I really do it? Let's find out. I'm going to set a timer. When it goes off, you guys will know if I accomplished it or not. But really, I'm going to set it for like 25 minutes because like I have to explain some things too. So that is going to start in a little bit. Let's get right into it. All right, so I did a brow tutorial, so my brows are already done. Make sure you go check out that video. So first, we're just going to start off with some eyeshadow. Let me start this timer so you guys know that I really did do it in 20 minutes or less. <laughs> I posted on um, Instagram and everyone's blowing me up about it. All right, let's go. Starting. Add it five minutes just because, you know, you never know. So I'm going to be using my Warrior by Hoovia's Place. I love, love, love this palette. So I'm going to take a transition shade and I'm just gonna use this shade. So we're just gonna fluff that in there. You're just going to take it and swipe it all across. Yes. Circular motions, circular motions, and going across. You just want to make sure that your crease is very defined since you're doing a very quick look. So then we're going to take, that was the color Kano by the way. So then we're going to take just a regular eyeshadow brush um, and we're going to use the color I'm really tempted to use this, but if it doesn't turn out right, then I'm going to be like, mm. We're going to mix Ahos and Amelia. Yeah, we're going to do that and see how that turned out. Alright, so our eyeshadow is done. If you want to, you can definitely um, take the Kano again and just defined, define it a little more. It's all up to you. But time's a waste, so we move on. Alright, next we are going to take our e.l.f. 16 hour camo conceal and that is going to be in the color tan sand. Really, the concealer is really the most important part. So you're going to take your concealer, <laughs> you're gonna take your concealer and you're gonna go right here, a little triangle, right here, a triangle. Then you're gonna take a straight line up here. I'm going to move my hair so you guys can see just a little bit better. All right, it is so dark outside. And then you also take it you go on your nose, right here, Cupid's bow, and my butt chin. Gotta go to the butt chin. Alright, so after that you're going to want to blend, blend, blend. And to do that we're going to use our e.l.f. beauty blender. You usually just quickly spray it with water, but since I'm on a timer, I'm going to just keep, I'm going to waste all my little sun spray and just do that. I didn't even need to wipe this one. All 
All right, so after our concealer, we're going to go in with our foundation. I'm using NARS in the color Hueheen. I love this foundation. It's their soft matte foundation and it really gets the job done. And you're gonna see the trick that I do. So what I do is I take it and I just drip it right here. Take it and drip it on the side of your face. There'll be excess. You don't wanna use too much product for your face. That is the worst. All right, so. Just pat, 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 pat. Pat your wee baby, baby. Pat your face, baby, baby. You see how much, like, little product goes a very, very long way. I go on the side of my noses. <laughs> my noses. My nose. We're going to use our Laurel Geller Spackle in Deep. We're going to use this for contour. So what you do is you start from your ear and you take it all the way down. So you go, you don't start from your ear, but just make, trace the line and you go. And then you do the same on the other side. And I do not cream contour my forehead. I just feel like that's messy and I do not have time for mess. And then you also do your nose. So you, t from the starting of your eyebrow. And then guess what you do? Pat your face, baby. Pat your face, baby. So you're gonna wanna pat up because at the end of the day, you're trying to lift your face. You don't wanna bring it down. So make sure you're patting up. So I like to take this palette, the Morphe um, Deep Contour Palette, and I like to just kind of mix all the shades, except for this one I've learned, don't do that. Um, mix all these shades to get like a powder contour. And I use some brush I got from um, TJ Maxx. So nothing major, just a small brush that I got from TJ Maxx. And you just take circular motions, go up, throw that brush in a circle, throw that brush in a circle. Yes, throw that brush in a circle. <laughs> throw that brush in a circle. I kind of love it how like it's already glowing when we don't have any highlight on. That's amazing. So then you're just gonna take the light color, which is donut, pat, 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 and we're just gonna do like this. So start on the bottom, because you you know, you'd rather have something on the bottom rather than the top. Then you're just gonna outline your nose. You're gonna take it all the way to your your eyebrow. So just do all that. And you good. What we're gonna do is take the mini bite size blush and highlight duo. We're just gonna use the blush. This is from e.l.f. It was all of three dollars, you guys. Three whole dollars. That is it and that is all. We're going to take our Morphe brush, R14, and we are going to just pat it. Just pat it, nothing major. All that, all that fly away. So when I, I just do circular motion up, I bring it to my temples. I do this for highlight, contour, and blush. Bring it to your temples. All right, so now we're gonna take our Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit. This thing has been used, you guys. I've had this for a long time. I'm not sure if makeup expires, but I've had this for a very long time. So literally, I just mix all the colors. These are my favorite, but I've, I've learned that I can't keep using those because, um, well, it will go out. So you'll notice that I don't, when I'm doing a very quick makeup look, I'm usually doing a very quick event. So I do not put setting powder on my face 
when I am looking to just stay in the house because that stuff will make your makeup stay on all day and it you don't want to make your um cleaning process difficult so I then take after you highlight your cheeks you take your highlight brush from the, your point where you start your contour and blush all the way up to your temple then you're going to take your M496 brush from Morphe and you're just going to take the lightest color or darkest color, you can mix them both, it doesn't matter, I usually just mix them or take the lightest color and you're going to do a vertical line right here or you can do a horizontal, dip it again, do horizontal this way dip it again, horizontal on your lips and last but not least you're going to take it and highlight that brow bone you're going to give it the biggest pop alright so now our face is basically done we are going to go to our lips crime is happening who did what? Outlash London the brown liner, I will link that below. You can also use my promo code Kara K. Get it right. Get it right. <laughs> and I'm gonna be using Peanut Brittle from Kiss. You can get this at any local beauty supply store. And then I'm also gonna top it with Morphe and Jeffree Star gloss. So you just you outline your lips. Literally just outline whatever shape they are. Do not overdraw your lips. And then after that, you take it and you go down the middle. My lips are kind of dry right now. Little stars. You can take your finger and do like this. Do what you gotta do, sis. And then we are going to fill it in with peanut butter brittle or peanut brittle. Okay, so basically our face is done. We still have six minutes left, so that's going to be dedicated to lashes, but we both know you have to wait for it to dry and all that. So I'm going to do that off screen. Well, I could do... Mm, no, nah, I just... I'll just do it, but I'm going to... Whatever. This might not work, y'all, because it's not going to work right now. Okay. All right, you guys. So that is how you do a full glam. Full glam, and we bam, ba ba bam. <laughs> All right, guys. So that's how you do a full glam in under 20 minutes, 25 minutes, because it didn't even ring. So 25 minutes, it didn't even go off. Um, I did pause it, stopped it because it was the glue was drying. But anyway, we still had six minutes left when I finished the face, and then putting on lashes is, is its own little beast. So. Hope you guys really enjoyed. If you guys want to know where I got something or any technique, just let me know. Here y'all can look at the details. The details. Alright babes, like I said, if you new here, if you new here, I'm going to need you to hit that subscribe button now. What are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button now. <laughs> Alright you guys. 
ciao. It was so much fun. Please comment below if you want me to record anything, want me to answer any questions. I got you. This is all for you. It's about you. Join the gang. Gang, gang. <laughs>